question, what's double processing and why should you care? We'll explain in just a moment. Hello and welcome everybody to this monumental insight. My name is Steven. I am the marketing manager here at Techstone. Now, if you're not already familiar with the term double processing, by the end of this video, you're going to have yet another insight as to the quality Textone provides both its retailers and their families. Now, double processing is a multi-step method in which the granite gets sandblasted with lettering and design. To better explain this, we sat down with Mr. Lee Geiger. Lee is the production floor supervisor here at Techstone. His background includes four years active military special operations. Thank you for your service, Mr. Geiger. Techstone appreciates all our veterans. Now, additionally, Lee taught four years aircraft maintenance, design, and theory, and he has over 20 years experience in the memorial industry, where he's done everything from retail sales to customer service to production and also installation. Now, Lee has been with Techstone since 2015, and he agreed to sit down with me to better explain double processing. By double processing your stone, you're actually physically removing your panel. You're frosting it back, putting the panel back in. So it's not like you're putting the stencil on one time. Uh, you actually put the stencil on twice. You're putting it on, cutting out the areas you need to frost, removing those, frosting them, putting those panels back in, and then cutting everything into it. Double processing gives you a cleaner cut line, more defined. It's actually a more professional way of doing things. And that's why so many of the better companies have always stuck with double processing. If I blasted a panel single process and frosted it off and already had the letters and stuff in there, I really can't go over there with a pneumatic chisel. Uh, I would just end up destroying stuff. If you would double process it, you frost it off, and you can turn around and hand tool that panel uh, prior to blasting it, put the stencil in, and have a hand tooled surface. There's so much you can do with it that you really can't do with a single process. So technically speaking, I mean, without a doubt, it's, it is the industry standard. It takes more people to do a double process and it takes more separate workstations but when you're dealing with quality and I mean true quality the quality is well worth it you need to look at that versus the cost and we're not expensive I think that's why we've stuck with double processing throughout our whole time here Now, just in case double processing now makes sense, but you're a little fuzzy as to what it means to single process, here it is. Single processing puts the stencil on once. 
They then pluck and remove all the deep cut V lines in the design lettering, send it into the blast booth where they sandblast those deep lines. They then remove the stencil where the frosted panels are to be and go over it again. Now the abrasive can erode and abrade those crisp, fine lines that make up the letters and the design, and that is why Techstone insists on doing double processing. We believe any memorial that's destined to last forever should at least arrive at the gravesite in the most perfect condition possible. Thank you for watching Money Mill Insights. We'll see you again soon.